And also the magic phrase, criminal referrals yes. to the Justice Department. Yeah. Um, here's the key. Uh, I'm reading the uh, Washington Post piece about this, their public hearings, mm -hmm. and they said they're also exploring how Trump has been able to convince so many of his supporters the election was stolen despite having no evidence yeah. to support this claim. Yeah. Uh, I think that Trump and his team have done a pretty masterful job of exploiting millions of Americans, said one committee aide. How do you get that many people screwed up that deeply and continue to screw them up, right? What do we do about that? So there's some really big, big picture items that go well beyond the events of January 6th. Um, partially reviewing the Electoral Count Act. Uh, members of the panel said they re want to review the laws that provide a president with emergency powers so those powers cannot be abused if a future election is contested. Huge. Uh, we still have a lot of work. Trump proofing the presidency so the next autocrat doesn't yeah. Uh, yeah. um yeah a nearly a year after the attack Thursday right as mm -hmm. our as the anniversary of yeah. the uh, January 6th attack a strong majority of Americans condemn it and believe Trump is at least partially uh, partially to blame <laughs> partially um, partisan splits have hardened over time, though, with Republicans largely backing Trump's versions of event, according to a new ABC uh, Ipsos poll. 72% um, of Americans believe the people involved in the attack were threatening democracy, um, while one in four, that's 25%. Not Chris, heard, yes. Mm -hmm, yeah. uh, believe the individuals were protecting democracy. So once again, the vast majority of us are saying have believe Joe Biden won the election. So let's go from there, right? Um, Democrats, um, 96 perceive... 6% believe that uh, those involved in the attacks were threatening democracy. Republicans more split. 45% said it was a threat. 52% say those involved were protecting democracy. Those are the startling statistics. Yeah. Though That and the number that, what is it, 40% think violence might be necessary. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. and, and Marjorie Taylor Greene talking about, you know, a national divorce. You're talking about civil war, you idiot. Right. Like the way people lightly use secession or civil war is just... Okay. 65% of Americans believe Biden's victory was legitimate. Nearly all Democrats, 93%. Um, but among Republicans, 71% side with Trump's false claims that he was the rightful winner. I, I don't know what to do. This is the Trumpism that he's dragged in, is that they, they will never admit an election loss again. Mm -hmm. Right? It's just, it, 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 we, ha we have no sense of shared, what's the word? Just reality. Reality.